It's my pleasure to welcome on the show this morning our very, very special guests, Lungile Mabasa and Yvonne Mabasa. Good morning to both of you and welcome. Well, thank you. Thanks for coming in. Yvonne, I'm going to start with you. I want to know why you wrote to Rich for a Dream because this morning we want to take hands with them. Uh, but I need to know more about that. Uh, how did you reach out to them? About young Lungile, obviously. Yeah. Uh, they are the one who found Lungile at the hospital. Tell me more. So, what are we dealing with here? What were the what are the challenges you're facing? The challenges is because he's not sick. He's not okay. He's sick. He's okay. Tell me more about that. Uh, it's about the tumor that mm -hmm. he, he was having, but he, they already took it out now. Okay. And when did you realize that he has this tumor? Mm, or shall I say, how did you realize? He was complaining about the pain on the underneath the belly. Okay. Yeah, so I took him to the GP and then they gave us like painkillers and then the doctor advised us to go and do the, the x-ray if it continues, the pain if it, it continues. So we drink the medication was fine for a few days or few weeks if I'm not mistaken but I can't remember from when so the pain started again so I took him to the doctor again and then that's where they did the x-ray and then they said there's a, a growth so but they're not sure mm. what is it yeah so they referred us to the specialist mm. at uh, Netcare Unitas. yeah yeah, that's where they did more scans, sauna, and then they said it looks like a tumor, tumor that causes cancer. Yeah. Yeah, so from there, like, it was like a, from one doctor to another doctor, mm -hmm. from one specialist to another specialist. So, like, yeah, it was a, like a disaster. Did it take uh, heavily on you to... Yes. You were obviously, I mean, you his mother. You were yeah. worried. Yeah. What is uh, the prognosis? What 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 is the news? What is what lies ahead? They've taken the tumor out. What yes. did the doctors tell you? Uh, right now, they have not yet uh, given us like the the result of the tumor. Really? Yeah. All right. Because they said they have to still take it to the lab, check. Yeah. Sure, sure. Yeah, if it's something which is living or like it's a long process. Gile, how are you feeling? Uh, uh, I'm not feeling okay. What? Uh, tell me how you're feeling. Uh, I feel like uh, at first I thought my life was going to end in just no time before I even uh, before I even achieve my dreams. Mm. Yes. Mm. And you're still so young. Yes. But it seems like you're in good hands. Yes, I am in good hands. And your mom, she's been there for you. Yes. <laughs> Makes you happy to know. Um, and what are your dreams? Tell me about that. I, I have most important three dreams. Uh huh. Yeah. One is to become a music producer. Okay. Okay. Uh, so. To become that, I was inspired by a lot of artists who produce on a piano. Ah. On a piano? Yes. Okay. All right. Yeah. So you want to become, you want to be a producer? Yes. What does it take to be an Ama piano producer? I mean, tell me. I love music. I live for music. I'm a musician, not I'm a piano musician. <laughs> so I'm asking because I don't know. I mean, what, what does it take? Is it something you can produce at home? Yes, you can produce it at home. A lot of people do. Yes. They produce amazing, amazing work from home these yeah. days. Uh, what does it take? I mean, what does one need to become an I'm a piano you need, producer? You need to have like connections. Let me see. <laughs> Find out you are doing music at home. You need to know people who produce music. Like maybe instance, a DJ, for example, Mr. JZQ. Then you meet up with him and then you become 
mates or buddies then you start producing music together because they guys like who is it do you say jazzy q jazzy q he can give you direction and, and help you and is a good person to know yes all right so have you met jazzy no have you reached out to him did you yes they tried reaching out to him they, they tried yes okay so so okay firstly so you need that good connection you need the you know direction uh, from a, a producer, mm-hmm. which is obviously makes sense. Yes. Um, do, what kind of equipment would you need yeah. to produce Ama Piano? Uh, mostly for Ama Piano, I think the most important is a keyboard, a screen, a microphone, and maybe speakers. Yeah. So okay. I, you know what? When uh, when we uh, when we decided to take hands with Reach for a Dream. Um, and and heard about your request and your dream and your life and your drive and your love for music, it immediately excited us. Mm. I mean, I absolutely, oh man, I live for music. Music makes a lot of things better for me anyway, someone who loves music. And I can tell you, you're a big music lover, uh, but not, not only do you want to listen to it, you want to produce it, you want to make it and share it. Because making music and sharing it with other people Especially if they like it, yes, and they jam along. Yeah, there's nothing better in the world at all. <laughs> I tell you what, that is just a feeling that never ever grows old. It's like when you hear someone else playing your music, or someone comes to you and says, "Hey, man, I love that song. Yeah, it means this and this and this uh, to me in my life." Yes, I think it's an amazing thing. Okay, so you're saying uh, a keyboard. Right. So um, would something like this possibly be a good start? What is that? Well, I, I, I think I know what it is, but oh. I'm not. <laughs> just, just open this. If you don't mind, just open that for me. Just to see if that, if that would be a good start. Just, just to see if it's a good start. Thank you, Nick. <laughs> what is that? Is that? Wow. This looks like the real deal, man. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. Uh-huh. <laughs> what is your name? Huh? Kiletso. Kiletso. Just help, help Lungile there. You, you're the friend. Take it out. Take it out, guys. Take it out. It's, I think it's more for me now. I'm very curious. <laughs> <laughs> so, to see what we're dealing with here. So that, that looks like the real thing that you need to produce the kind of music that, that, you, that you need to do. Does it make you happy? Yes, it does make me happy. Does it? Now, you smiled for the first time yeah. since you got here this morning, <laughs> yes. which makes me very, very happy. That is amazing. That's a good start. But I'm guessing that you're going to need some more than that. Right? Yes, yes yeah. of course. I want to invite some special guests and friends into the studio to come and join us here for a moment. If you, if you turn around and you look at the door, uh, it's my pleasure to say welcome to DJ Jazzy Q. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Lungilo, are you surprised? Yes, Is this a good surprise? Jazzy, what do you have there for him? Some more gifts to open. He can open it. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Uh, Jazzy, I'm going to ask you to jump on that microphone there, man. And thanks, thanks, for, thanks for joining us, Jazzy. Thanks for having me. I must just be honest, this worked out perfectly because he said, this, this worked out perfect because he said, <laughs> a guy like Jazzy Q, and I'm like, wow. <laughs> How happy does it make you to hear that a young man like Lungilo wants to follow in your footsteps to produce Ama Piano music? Um, it makes me feel great because I mean, um, I can also, I'm, I'm able to inspire others to actually become something, you know, and they can do better than whatever that they want to achieve in life. So it actually gives me a lot of joy, happiness, you know. Um, it's, it's actually overwhelming for me as well because it's just like I don't know if I could touch people like that you know but well you can yeah, yeah, yeah. and you did gents let's talk about the hardware here and the software and everything else that goes there. what is that so that obviously looks like the um, yes, I think it's uh, the laptop open it guys I'm way too curious What's yeah <laughs> I want to know I want to know you get presents you got to get yeah, them open yeah, yeah. can you open it is it possible um, so, so, so what is in there Jazzy um, it's a it's a brand new laptop. 
a brand new laptop because that's how you can produce these days. Yeah. You need a keyboard and a laptop and a good program. What program do you use? I use Fruity Loops. Fruity Loops? Are you kidding me? Yep. Are we still, is Fruity Loops still the thing? <laughs> My guy. Fruity Dude. Loops. Fruity Loops is the hottest thing right now. <laughs> I cannot believe that. <laughs> and you know, we get the same reaction all over around the world because people keep asking us, what do you guys use to produce? I'm like, I love that. Uh, Cubase, nah. No, Fruity Loops. Fruity Loops. And, and it's just, you it's, know, it's mind still blowing. People are just like, how are you doing it with that thing? I'm just like, that thing is comfortable. <laughs> Dude, it works. <laughs> and it works. It still works. Yeah. It's still the best there is. It makes me so happy. Oh, that looks very, very good, guys. Yvonne, you've uh, you helped there. Let's have a look. Uh, Lungine, just describe for everyone listening from home at the moment. What do you see in front of you? What do you have? So, in front of me, I see... So, in front of me, I see um, a home audio keyboard. All right. This is 49 keys, I think. And then next to me, my mom's holding a laptop, I think, yeah. So as I understand it, as I understand you and, and Jazzy Q here, this is what the guys are using all over the world to produce some of the best music. Isn't it incredible how technology has mm. given us yeah. that ability to do this? So you can be producing, I'm a piano, uh, for, but listen, let me shut up and you can ask this guy here. Here's this idol of yours. Yeah. This amazing DJ right here in studio with us this morning. What do you want to know from him? What kind of question do you have for him? Hey, how, how did you start producing music? Um, I firstly started as a DJ. I started as a DJ. I, was, I started DJ when I was 13. Um, <clears throat> it was a very big challenge because I come from an intellectual family. So, you know, it's books first. Yeah. And anything else after or never you know <laughs> <laughs> so it was very challenging but um because i had to spend a lot of time at home um i had to spend a lot of time with my books and stuff so i always had to seem like i'm close to my computer or reading some stuff but i would have my my, my actual book behind with like another book no. in the front oh, where I'm trying to like understand everything that's happening behind the music you know? <laughs> and then because my uncle was slick he would come to me and be like yo I need I need you to read this book you're gonna have to give it to me after five days now we have technology I just go to the internet I yeah. say summary <laughs> I come back to him like yeah <laughs> I got this <laughs> I love that story. <laughs> yeah. But listen, where there's a will, there's a way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. wanted so, to be in music. I had to. I had to find a way. Yeah. You know. Um. I started. I started because because I was listening to a lot of um, uh, deep house, Afro house. Yeah. So yeah. for me, it was you know. So I had to also like find my own identity. So that's when we started coming up with I'm a piano mm -hmm. and stuff like that. So, yeah, it was. It was very interesting. I have to ask, are your parents proud of you now? Very. Yeah. yeah. Very. Now, yeah. They're blowing the horn yes. higher than I am. <laughs> Yvonne, what are your thoughts? You're the parent in the room. Are yeah. you happy for Lungile? Yeah, I'm very happy. Yeah, I'm very happy for him today. And then also, like, message from Jesse Q, the parents saying, education first. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, which is right. Yeah. Yes, it's right. <laughs> You must Absolutely. finish school and then you can do whatever that you want. I had to finish school and then I I I, I did whatever that I wanted. You know? <laughs> but um in everything that you do you need to oh, never forget your parents. So don't ever, no matter how much money you make, money doesn't mean anything if you don't have the people who are behind you. You get me? Yes. Thank you, Jesse Q. Thank you. That's beautiful. I love that so, so, so much. Uh, are you happier now? Yes, I'm very happy. Are you less worried now? Yes. Because right here, right today, and you've got this guy here in studio with you, you've got the equipment, you can live your life. Yeah, after today, of. he doesn't even have to go back to the doctor. Just get stuck <laughs> into that computer and the keyboards there and, 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 and fruity loops, yeah. man, Ooh. and you can make us. But now, yeah, you've got to promise me one thing now. Once you've made your first song, right, mm. you got to send it to us. I want to hear it. I need some songs. You need some songs, but you're going to make them. Yes, yeah. You're going to make them. What, what is your favorite uh, Ama Piano? What are the big songs? Educate me. 
Like, what do you mean big songs? What is the biggest I'm a piano song in the world now? He will tell you. What's the biggest song right now? And I would say Kilimanjaro, yeah. You like that? Mm. And yours, you would say? It's my song, so yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that. Man. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Not biased. <laughs> right, to, right to the top. Right to the top. Well, I would have to play some of that for everyone listening this morning for sure. And I want to wish you all the best with your journey. Mm -hmm. um, because that's what it's about. It's about what you're doing today. Yeah. And today, my friend, you are going to be producing Ama Piano music. And you're going to be great. <laughs> And I can see you're very excited for your yeah. friend as well. There's a big yeah. smile. Yvonne, nice to meet you. All the best. I'm so, so glad that you um, that you reached out to Reach for a Dream. Reach for a Dream, thank you very much for reaching back out to us and, and taking hands. Jazzy, you're the man. Thanks for coming in. I love what you said. I love what you did this morning. Thanks for Jazzy, having me. you've got another new fan, maybe a, a million more. You never know after this morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you for what you've done. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. And you, you just keep dreaming, man. Dream, produce, send. I'll play. <laughs> nice to meet you all. Thank you. Good job, angels. Good job. Cheers. Good morning, angels. Breakfast with Martin Bester. Six to nine weekdays. Exclusive to Jacaranda FM.